Hey everybody, welcome to Overcoming My Lung Disease. Donnie P here, your humble host. This is episode number 88. A lot of videos out there so far, and it's been so much fun bringing these to you. This week, what I want to talk about is, um, well, for those of you who've been following my channel, you know that in January, I adopted a whole food, plant-based lifestyle, which meant I cut out all animal products. I cut dairy out. And I went as far as to cut sugar out, and I made some radical changes, and I was proud of myself. I did it from January till the, I want to say the end of July. I guess that's, I don't know, it's a lot of months, right? Maybe eight months. And um, then, I mean, I can't make any excuses. It's my own fault. But uh, I guess I fell off the wagon, and I was at some parties and some weddings, and whatever the excuse was, I kind of lost my willpower and said, ah, let me, I, I was good so far, let me give it a shot, let me try to eat some regular food, see what that's like, see how I feel, and I enjoyed the taste of regular food, of course, like everybody else, and I started to have coffee, I had cut caffeine out, coffee again, and putting the cream in my coffee, and I was having regular pizza and such. And so I brought a lot of dairy back into my diet. And um, it's been, well, today is November 1st. So uh, happy November 1st. Uh, happy belated Halloween to everybody out there. And um, so August, so September, October, November, uh, I guess going on three months, I've been off the uh, proverbial dairy wagon <laughs> and uh, just off the wagon. And I noticed changes. I noticed a lot of changes and people told me during those months that my skin looked good and I noticed that too and things had cleared up and my breathing was a lot better and I didn't have any phlegm problems or any issues and I'm going to tell you for the last, I don't know, month and a half or so, I've been having chronic issues with phlegm. I'm taking uh, Mucinex now on a daily basis. I have a cough and I have a little bit of a, a slight wheeze. Like an, almost like an asthma wheeze that every once in a while comes back. And sometimes I get some headaches and I just I felt like my resistance is down. And I have not been feeling like I was feeling for those seven, eight months that I was completely whole food plant-based. And, you know, dairy-free especially. So I guess I have to look at this like uh, I got clinical conclusive evidence for myself. Remember, I'm only talking for me. I'm not telling anybody out there what to do. This is my experience and I'm sharing it with you. So for me, I conclusively learned the hard way <laughs> that uh, dairy really causes a lot of mucus buildup. It makes it harder for me to breathe with my lung disease. And um, I started to bring back in the green smoothies that I was missing. These are them right here. Cheers, everybody. So I'm starting to, one second, mm, really delicious. I swear. What that is, I'm, I'm incorporating every day like I used to. Again, spinach and kale, a ton of it into my, into my smoothies. It's uh, almond milk, not regular dairy, which is great, unsweetened, no sugar. It's kale, it's spinach, flax seeds, chia seeds, and then I sweeten it up to make it taste really good with frozen strawberries. So that's natural sugar, but frozen strawberries and um, and the banana. I put a banana in there. And I'll tell you, I'm flooding my system with really good chlorophyll and nutrients. And I, uh, I started drinking the smoothies only a couple of days ago, and I can already feel a difference. I'm not craving the coffee. I stopped coffee again. I'm not craving that, and uh, yeah, I'm cutting uh, dairy back out. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to go about it, maybe we can call it like an 80-20 or a 70-30 rule. I'm going to try to do whole food plant-based again. I actually like the way it made me feel. <coughs> Excuse me, you can, you can hear the congestion and the cough, and I'm not making this up for the video. It's wild. So uh, I, I like the way I was eating back back then for those seven months. I figured out great recipes and ways to cook and people were like, how can you do that? That's so radical. It really was amazing. And and my wife did it with me as well. And to tell you the truth, she was like, I can't believe you fell off the wagon and, and it's hard for me to stay on this if you're not going to do it. And she kind of fell off the wagon. She's getting headaches and she's not feeling really good. I noticed that my skin doesn't look as good as it was looking. I have puffiness under my eyes. That, I, that went away. People were like, what, what are you doing? What's going on? You look different. 
And I noticed that, I mean, there, there was the puffiness. You could look at my older videos for seven months and tell me what you think. I mean, there was definitely a difference in in my uh, my skin tone. And I just, I had a more vibrant look. I felt just more alive. I mean, it, it's amazing. So I learned the hard way. And I'm going to go back to what I said, like 80, 20, 70, 30. I'm going to do whole food plant-based. But I'm not going to be so absolutely rigid and crazy if I'm at a wedding or if something happens, yeah, every once in a blue moon, if I want to cheat, so be it. I mean, I didn't cheat, not one iota for the first seven months. But now, you know, I, I did cheat after those seven months. And then I said, oh, this is really good. But I'm not going to let that happen again because I know for me that it's not like it's forever. That I could never, ever, ever have a slice of pizza or whatever because it's just going to be that one meal. But I'm not going to go back to the way, at least I'm going to try not to go back to the way of eating where it's chronically putting that phlegm into my body and, and all that dairy and all that stuff that's just not good for me. See, I'm saying it's for me. I really can't speak for anybody else. Well, my wife would say the same thing, but she's at work. If she was here, she'd pop her head in and she would, she would agree. So that's what this video is about. I'm actually going back to my healthier ways. I'm back on the wagon and I'll report to you how I'm feeling. And, uh, Hopefully, it'll make a big difference and turn everything around. I'll get rid of this nasty phlegm and that tickle and that little wheeze that's driving me crazy. And I'll start to feel like I did feel for that seven months that I was doing the whole food plant base exclusively. So that's what I'm talking about this week. Just wanted to tell you I share everything with you guys. That's what's going on. And uh, if you like my videos, don't forget, give them a thumbs up and don't forget to leave comments down below. Tell me your story. Tell me what you guys are doing and up to. And let me know what you think. If you want to hear something or see a certain video next week or in the following weeks, let me know. Give me some topics. I want to know what you guys want to hear about. I would love to talk about it. And uh, as always, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I want to get an army of people that are out there watching these videos because hopefully I'm giving you great information and hopefully I'm making you feel a little bit better because that's what this is is all about. And as I say in all my videos, I'll see you guys next week. And remember, live inspired. <laughs>